Hello and welcome. Absolutely ideal weather for football here in Manchester at the Etihad. I'm Derek Ray getting ready to bring you all the action accompanied by my broadcasting partner Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is a foot rivals match on the menu. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. challenge far from a good pass well here is the lineup for the hosts today Alphonse Areola between the posts Lucas Klosterman plays alongside Joe Gomez in central defense Wilfred Zaha plays with Christopher Nkunku in the engine room and it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat oh great attacking play well, fantastic reflex action. Trying to pick out a teammate. 
But he didn't miss by all that much with the header. Just a little bit off target. Well, he's currently on 49 goals. Is today the day when he bags his 50th for the club, Stuart? Well, he just loves to score goals, doesn't he? Whether they're tappings or great strikes. And he's always putting his body on the line to be first to the ball. He's a top goal scorer. Good-looking move there. Oh, he's through here. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? A very effective challenge put in. And unable to keep possession. Eusebio. Oh, left his man behind here. But no damage done, that's the main thing. And now he must score! And a goal it is, the keeper really not part of the equation. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. Well, a second goal for them here. Nkunku. Nkunku. Surely. And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Müller. Grunefeld. Is it going to be... And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. We take it short. Opportunity for Müller. Not out of the woods yet. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? And by a wafer-thin margin, offside. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. And he might be through here. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. I just wanted some more, what of a twist? More? Think I didn't take risks to get to this sitch? Don't take the... No. Well, I've got me, I admit I did what I did, but I deserve this. That's no. why the f*** got popped at six. I know all about f*** by the evening. I used to think I'm just dreaming. More. I just wanted some more, what of a twist? More. Think I didn't take risks to get to this sitch? Don't take the... Don't do it. Well, I've got me, I admit I did what I did, but I deserve this. Yeah. That's why the f*** got popped at six. I know all about f*** by the evening. I used to think I'm just dreaming. No. Now I'm up on my ex girls, all in her feelings. It's too late, darling, could a ship is held away from your reach and ain't one for preaching. But I come a long way from all the rules I was preaching. Some lessons there ain't no teaching. Gotta do it and learn for yourself. I never did want no help. They just told me it's worrying about my health. 
Cause I've had four, four and three shots of when it's half past twelve. Oh, in the afternoon, not the morning. Told him it's evening time somewhere else in the world. Plus I Hello everyone and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from division rivals. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Keeping the opposition at bay with that splendid challenge. The starting lineup for Trojans. Alisson begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Joe Gomez in central defence. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. And I think we're always going to refer to Pelé as the king. Stuart, what might we see from him in this match? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Pelé. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Kunku and he takes it away and do they mean business on this occasion what a powerful effort but he couldn't quite keep the shot down Lam, sloppy in possession, the Trojans. Pele. And Best has it. Tonali with it. showing good patience and it's still on for him Thomas Müller Jules Kunde on the ball moving into the advanced position but nothing comes of it good defending it was Will it happen for them? Pele. It's Pele. Just made sure nothing came of that. Pele. And it's Tavernier. Sandro Tonali. It might be on for them. Lam. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Kunde. Müller. Lima on the ball. And the emphasis is on creativity. Nkunku. Grunefeld Konrad Leimer Müller well not quite what he wanted to do with the pass 
Well, the hosts, as you can see, have enjoyed so much possession. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. Diaby. Something to worry about here. Grunefeld. And still an opportunity. And he's won the ball. Pele. Tonali with it. A glorious chance. James Tavernier. Sandro Tonali. the replay and it just highlights his skill level here he does so well to keep it down that's a really good half volley and well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks we're at the end of 45 minutes in this game you certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point Stuart well I'm sure that with him And the second half underway, the Trojans with the lead, but still with work to do. Konrad Leimer. Diaby. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Domenico Berardi. Pele. Wonderful chance! Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Now the delivery. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Who can he pick out? Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. Thomas Müller. Breaking at pace. Oh, good vision. Oh, it almost did the trick for them. Great defending. Lorenzo Insigne. Sandro Tonali. Effective challenge. Grunefeld. Diaby. And he takes on the shot. Superb block. Well, they are behind, but can they give themselves a boost with this corner? Lorenzo Insigne, Pele, and attempting the through ball, in it goes, delighted to be two in front, things look good for them now, so 2-0 now, run it superbly to take back possession, Grunefeld Nkunku and a very good challenge and breaking at pace with Menace 
Can they keep it going? Takes the shot. Oh, a clinical counter-attack. And so close to a goal. Well, that's exactly what they're looking to do. Force the turnover and then break at pace. So close to a very good goal. And space here on the flank. But quick thinking defensively. Well, as you can see, the hosts have controlled the possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Nkunku. Lima on the ball. Oh, that's a really good run. Interception to snuff out the danger. James Tavernier. Will he play it in? Very quick thinking there. What can they do from here? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Pele. Well, a failure to keep the ball by Trojans. Conrad Leimer. Leimer on the ball. Well, that pass easy on the eye. That's all they can conjure for now. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Oh, good looking run. Is it going to be? And he quartered the attack with a masterful tackle. Grunefeld. A sloppy pass. How can he take them on and beat them? Could be dangerous. On to Pele. Really good timing stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Who can he pick out? And turned onto the woodwork. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop and then the reaction. Grunefeld. Well, we'll soon be hearing the final whistle, and this is a performance to forget about from the point of view of the visitor, Stuart. Well, there's been a real lack of energy right from the start of the game, certainly when they haven't had the ball. They're closing down, decision-making and recovery runs just haven't been good enough. Nkunku, determined defending. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Grunefeld. Could pull one back here. Which he does! And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe in terms of the scoreline as far as the visitors are concerned.
Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we have a foot rivals match coming up for you. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to... Chance here! Oh, body in the way, crucially! Possession again with the Foxes. Best. Conrad Leimer. Diaby. Clean challenge. Grunefeld. Now able to close down the shot. Did well to win the ball back. And the Foxes pushing forward with options available. But ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Nkunku, danger averted, could play it in, but his technique seemed to let him down, it'll be a goal kick. Kimmich, and winning it back. Müller. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Now, how about the short corner? And a good-looking ball. The clearance wasn't decisive. Reading it well. A spot on with that challenge. And the Foxes failed to keep the ball. Moving it forward. Thomas Müller. And it's with Grunefeld. Big chance. A smart stop here. And taken short. Diaby. Klaus. Promising sequence. 
Superb block. In the right place to cut out the pass. Well, he could run onto it here. Can he keep his composure? And there is the opening goal. Well, arguably against the run of play, they've been second best up to this point, but they have the lead. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Good pressure high up the pitch. Conrad Leimer gives it a go. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Kunde. Promising move. Cutting the ball back. Really a very poor ball. Well, the visitors, as you can see, haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Well read to win possession back. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. An incisive pass. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Lam. Well, inching towards half time, and probably fair to say the fans were hoping for a little bit better than this. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. Grunefeld. And throwing himself up the ball. And deciding to go short with this one. Diaby. Nkunku. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Superb stop. Well, he's given it away. Moussa Diaby. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Nkunku. Diaby. And dispossessed. The first half here comes to an end. I think most fans... The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Müller. Leimer on the ball. Müller. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. And the counter looks on here, options available. The high press was very much on. Can he put it in? A goal! That's two for him today! They simply can't stop him! No wonder he's celebrating! So, 2-0 now. This might work out nicely for the Foxes. But ultimately, up a cul-de-sac.
did well to win the ball back. And the Foxes have it back. And he keeps going. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Playing it in. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. It's looking promising. De Bruyne. And a goal! To increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? So the action continues. It's been a masterclass from the Foxes. And it's a matter of how many. Grunefeld. This is looking threatening. Konrad Leimer. Nkunku. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Breaking at pace. Best. And it might be. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. And he's fired over the corner. And it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. And showing fine vision. Making progress. Diaby. Nkunku. Thomas Müller. Perfect tackle. And blocked for now. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Well, they've lost the ball. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Keeper is happy, the bar was there. Kimi, really a very poor ball. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Good technique displayed. But nothing comes of it. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Surely! He's given it straight to the opposition. Muller. Just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. And that's an important intervention. Jonathan Klaus. Best. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Kevin De Bruyne. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. And this is turning into something of a rat. 4-0. Müller. Well, he needed to read it to get there, and did. And just five minutes remaining.
Wonderful tackle. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, it petered out. Grunefeld. Defensive efficiency personified. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Moussa Diaby. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, they could run onto it here.